If you've been on my channel before, you know that I've raved about the Panasonic GH5 video capabilities, but I've been getting lots of questions about its photo capabilities. What you're seeing now are images that I've taken on my GH5 with either the Canon 24-70mm or the Tokina 11-16mm, both at a 2.0 with my Metab Metabone Speed Booster Ultra. And to be honest, I can't complain. I thought for months that I wouldn't even bother shooting photos on my GH5 because I heard it was so bad, but I've definitely changed my mind after trying it on a few recent trips. If you plan on blowing these up to billboard size, then yes, a Canon 1DX, a $10,000 camera, or any of the Canon full-frame cameras will beat the GH5 in most lighting conditions. But in the world of mobile consumption, your photos will be looked at on an iPhone probably like 95% of the time. So for me, I'm happy with it just for my Instagram and my website. I edit my GH5 photos in Lightroom using the photography preset pack, which is in the link below which I made specifically for the GH5 and in Adobe Lightroom. I think in the right hands the GH5 can produce pretty amazing still images. What do you think? Leave a comment below, tell me if you think I am wrong. Um, I think it's pretty great. I've thought about getting a Canon, but I think I'm going to stick with the GH5 and just see what I can do to push the limits of photography on it. Let me know if you want a full tutorial of how I set up my GH5 for photography. Just comment below and thanks for stopping by.